Hey yo guys, the name is Wolfenhager and welcome to the Wolves Den today. We're playing some more Street Fighter 6 World Tour mode, trying to get everyone mastered. These guys flying in the sky. Alright, so, first of all, sorry for not being around for the whole week. I've just been extremely tired after the move from the office and for some other reason I am burnt out every single day with no energy to play games. Just sucks. But, let's continue on. We got a message last time from Chun Li, ordinary girl. You know, I've always wanted to be an ordinary girl. That's it. Wait a sec. You just rolled your eyes. Even though, text, I can tell. Is that some kind of secret mystical kung fu ability? Don't tell me you have psychic powers. You could say that. The Kiko tells me everything, but joking aside, I do often wonder what ordinary even means. Everyone lives life their own way. In times of peace and strife alike, maybe ordinary is all in the eye of the beholder. No need to fret though. I am quite content with life just the way I am. I won't let the pain of the past or present drag me down. I strive to stay positive, always. And I consider myself blessed to have my students. Okay. You wanna get me again? Just chit chat. Can I talk to you about something? This drama series on TV had me in tears. We're talking TV now? What was that about? It's about a man overcoming danger in order to save his sick girlfriend. Hmm. You know, when I type it out like this, it really does sound generic. But in all sincerity, I really enjoyed it. Wow, look at us. Just chatting about nothing in particular. It feels like we've known each other forever. Anyways, talk to you later. Okay. Got me again? She's got me again. Alright. No. No? Why is the message symbol up there? Like nothing. Now it disappears. Alright. We were going to do Honda first. Uh, might be a bad idea. I don't think we got all the items, but we will try. I need to. Other people here. Okay, Mr. Honda. Let's gift you. Always looking forward to your sil souvenirs. Now this guy supposedly likes the rubber duckies. Where are the rubber duckies? Here we go, we got two for him. Yeah, Don't be fooled! This fella is a total monster. A dreaded foe who practically puts me in traction many years ago. Fine, it's just a bar toy. But once, one ended up on the floor. I was so focused on cleaning that I stepped on it, suffered a short rook and level damage to my foot, and flipped right over. Mm. Never again. Thanks for this. I'll hold onto it to ensure the tragedy is never repeated. Up by five. This guy's nearly there, which is cool. Oops, not that one. Let's do it again. That's the sumo spirit right there. Uh, DJ needs beers, so we're gonna spam this because I don't think he needs 40 of them. He don't need 40. This again! This fated foe of mine refuses to relent, but I ain't given up either. I'm gonna hold on to this for safekeeping. I'll be perfect memento for when I open my bathhouse in the city one day. <laughs> nice. Said 69! 69! Alright, let's gift him. Oops, shit. Oh, now this is something alright. Should I make a great decoration for Edamon? Brah, what did I just give you? Oh, premium cards, that's fine. Let's give you some lukewarm beer. You don't need this. Go up by two, please. Now this is something alright. Okay. Up by two, good. Nice all. We've got plenty of these to give out. 
Ay, shit. Man. Too fast on the buzzer. Seventy-seven. Got the way he moves himself out towards this. So funky ass. Let's see what we give him a fighter's magazine. He also gets two. That's cool. You can also spend these as well. We're gonna do DJ next because there's some stuff we're gonna buy at his place as well for items. And if we do run out of cash, we got a lot of iron to sink copper and uh, silver and gold to sell off. Plenty. And if we spam off the beers, we can give them to someone else as well. We also got Luke in this territory, which I'm forgetting. He, uh, Luke needs the red, the red elevator. Uh, red, uh, red elevator eight. I have no idea what that is. Nor do I care. And Jamie needs the bell stickers, so we can also give him. Kimberly, on the other hand, requires the romance. Oh, romance? Do I not have any romance magazines? I guess I don't. Hmm. Oh no, answers line the hard lot. It's not magazines, it's DVDs. DVDs! Not even Blue Race. Then again, she is old school, I guess. Okay. And. Oh shit! Continue my move and having put to work around town seems to be paying off. If this keeps up and Edelman starts getting slammed, I might have to start doing fan appreciation days. The two of us can team up and give my customers a get thrown around by a sumo wrestler experience. I also skipped a mid, uh, bit at the beginning. A little too on the nose, yeah. I had a feeling. <laughs> Just one more. Just one more. Ah, oh, okay. Uh. We'll give him a more beer. Others. All right, is at max. Let's talk all. Oh yeah, about that thing you mentioned the other day. To really bring sumo worldwide, I decided to rework my sumo poetry into what the kids refer to as a sick hip hop rap, and it goes a little something like this. Uh -huh. Grew up a troublemaker, eaten five times my size. TV sumo matches kept my eyes on the prize. Hundred hands slapping my way to the top. Then I bring the house down with a mighty sumo stomp. The sumo slam streets from Tokyo to Tibet. E Honda's the name, and don't you ever forget. Don't know about you, but I think I could go triple platinum. A wise man once said, food is strength. You know what? He was right. So, so right. Even better, I'm not picky. Never met a meal I haven't liked. <laughs> I've got opinions when it comes to seasoning though. Eating a delicious meal disastrous is no good. Way back I ran into a fighter who wanted to create food for us. Genuine, genuine fight chow. He appreciate good food just as much as I did, but the way he seasoned stuff you might as well be eating cardboard. It was a real shame. Hopefully one day I'll be able to make Chunko explosive enough to awaken his flavor senses. What do you think I should have him practice my by cooking at Edamon? <laughs> nope, not happening. Yep. It's him. Alpha Roti Patui. Anymore? Hey, I was looking to show up feeling hungry. Go on. A uh, world tour works up an appetite like nobody's business. Don't be shy with those chenko balls after this. Go ha ha ha. Ready to put your sumo skills to the test? That's the sumo spirit. Go ha ha ha. Let's see if I can do this again. Do I remember how to fight? We'll see soon enough. Oh, shake. 
Okay, I'm getting wolves. At least I'm level 93. Nice special moves. Okay, set it up. You're gonna hit by me somehow. Oh, 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 oh. Reads like a book. Bro. Guys coming out. Oh. Grabs me out of the drive. Let's see if he is. And again. Oh, shot. What is my... Do I actually show? I have no idea. I think we've got to burn it if I do have it. I'm gonna flame this guy. Oh! I don't have Shinsho. What do I have? Well, that's my super. Oh, I see. You're going for the ride, buddy. Oh, it kills. I've got nothing more to add. You know what you're doing, kid. Hey, look who shit up, feeling hungry. Yep, 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 yep. We've seen it. Alright, Honda's done. Over and out. So, from here, the easy thing I could really do is go for DJ. And DJ has some stuff that we need to get from Jamaica. was a lot of the stuff people had, need to get from him. Lugwambia for DJ is in his place. That bell sticker for Jamie. We already got that. And Teeth playing cards for JP. And answers lie in the heart of love. They're everywhere. Alright, well, I guess we're gonna be buying a lot of stuff here. At least a few. Under time. Quiz time! You know what this means? No. No. Down, 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 down. You know, my Honda. Now you say it gets too much thump. Sumos make friends of bitter rivals. Why not? Now that's clever. If I could convey that much without words, that's got to be proof of Sumos' progress towards worldwide record recognition. <laughs> I'm such an asshole. <laughs> Okay, here we go again. What's on the new menu? I'm cooking up a few new menu items for Edamon as we speak. I'm curious to hear what you think. Say you could even... You could... Say, could pick up anything to go with a big steaming bowl of chunko. What would you choose? Chunko pizza. Chunko dim sum. Oh. 
Now there's a surprise answer. In the ring of Dim Sum, Chinatown's basically the Yokozuna, but Enemon strives to become king of the ring. Now that's Sumo Showdown, you can set your watch to. Any more? We done? We done? We done? There we go, we done. Okay, let's give you some gifts. Oh wow, a present for me, man. Let's give you the lukewarm beer and smash you out. Yeah, really brought the goods, man. I'm throwing this in the refrigerator straight away. It's not supposed to be kept cool. My man, if you were looking to confuse your friend DJ, you did well. Beers meant to be kept cool. I'm not budging on this one. Yeah, I gotta agree with him on that. Hey! You giving me a present? Plenty of lukewarm beers. Hey! Yo, yeah, oh my man, listen. In Jamaica, drinking warm beer is strictly forbidden. Yo, That's right. Executive order, my man. We clear? <laughs> Thanks in advance, man. Yo, my mom, listen. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're her. Once we burn up all of DJ, we can give these drinks to other people. I think we need about maybe six for everyone. Six items for everyone. And he requires two. You know what? I'm gonna give him one of these. And that's gonna be one? That's two. Okay. Before we talk to this guy, Mr. Merchant, what have you got for me? Okay, General Store. So, we got blanket dolls. We got three. We need a few for. We need a. F it's a bar for. Six? Two, five, six. Okay, yeah, that should be enough for Blanca. Game magazine, not game, uh, Red Elevator 8. Let's get. Oh, oh. I've got plenty of cash. Plenty. I don't know who. Who uses the jelly eels? Let's see. <clears throat> okay, jelly eels. The answer to that is no one. No, I'm wrong. Cammy wants the jelly eel. Jelly eel. <clears throat> jelly eel for you, girl. Uh, to keep safe, maybe we'll buy two, um, uh, ten at least. Because we are, <clears throat> we're Mr. Moneybags. Don't need no bevels because Ben Jolas. This is gonna be Manon, right? Yeah, it is. And we need plenty of them. Who's celery chips? Lily wants celery chips. I don't think we've maxed out Lily. And this is for Kimberly. And this is for JP. Hopefully this, this will be enough for everyone. Okay, so we are all set for the other dudes. And when we go to the other places, we'll also buy stuff from there as well. 
I've been inspiring plenty of fighters over the years, man. There was one group that gave me serious bad boy vibes. <clears throat> Sega, the Empire, Muay Thai, Vega, and the, the Spanish Ninja. Belrog, the Wrecking Ball, and M. Bison, the Mad Maestro. I enjoyed fighting that quirky quartet. But from what I hear, they're no more. Creative differences, maybe a dispute over money. Whenever you got personalities that strong, you're all vibing for attention. Trouble's coming f for ya, mon. Very interesting. <coughs> <coughs> Yo, my mon, got a minute? Our time on this earth is limited, you know. So we're singing, we're dancing, we're fighting, and we do it all to the limit, mon. Makes us feel alive. But listen, my mon, even I, well, sometimes I gotta take a long, quiet look at myself. Somewhere secret, somewhere no one knows about. Sometimes that kind of thing can do us good, my mon. Okay. When you're learning to sing, play, an instrument, or fight, you gotta start by imitating others. Which brings us to you, my mom. With my moves, show me what you've got to take to be me. Hell up, wanna get that body moving? I think we're, we're here, we'll finish this guy off. Alright, <clears throat> you're gonna come out like a horse on fire. No, he doesn't, I'm wrong. Ooh, you wanna get hot? Come on, that's rubbish. Oh, I can't even whip him on my own. No. Own ones. Why? Crazy. Keep away. Move set. Works out quite well. Ooh. Can't even judge what I'm doing from the side. Crosses up into super level two. Level two. Eat this. Eat. That's not what I'm looking for, but that does hell of a lot of damage. Ah, change of sides. I was gonna go for the big one. I'm gonna change it back to Shinsho. Shinsho is easier to pull off. The rhythm of battle is everything, my mom. I did. Yep. Okay, done. Next up. Let's see where we're gonna go. I I would like to finish on Metro to be honest. Let's go to the training center and we will do Luki. Let's do Luki. Then we can change it to nighttime and do Jamie and Kimberly. And did we do Ken? I don't think I got all Ken stuff. Hey, we'll come back for Ken. Ken needs a cookbook. Maybe we did. No, we did do Ken. This is what happens when you don't continue one after so long. Get everything. So, Ken, Chuns, Honda has been done. Loot to be done. Jamie and Kimberly. Who should we do last? Well, we've done Ryu. Mm. Who would do JP last? 
Okay, bummer. You really help get me fired up. Eye to eye, hand to hand, body to body. We synchronize in perfect harmony. As we float over the tropical sands, we were a perfect mate. So why are you mad? Uh, what's up? Oh, just the lyrics. I was inspired by the time we spent together, so I decided to write a love song. It's straight from the imagination, but I wanted to add your reactions to the mix. So I sent the lyrics here, and now I'm gonna add your response as the icing on the cake. Much thanks. Okay. I'm waiting. <laughs> Come on now. The party is mashing up the place. Why will you no show? What's wait, what party? First I've heard of it. A health party thrown by DJ himself, and my party rule is always shake things up. So I wanted to up the surprise factor this time. The plan was to have us fight as part of the main event. Guess I forgot to mention that part. Oh well. Everyone makes mistakes. I'll break it to everyone real nice and gentle. And I'll invite you proper next time so I'd better see you there. Right. Oh yeah. We're controllers. Oh, the old. Let's go. Disconnected. We can run around without the thing. With well, a right control stick. It'll work. Okay. Let's go, Luke. Gift off. Ah, uh, shucks. Time to crack this bad boy open. Where is your elevator eight? Red elevator. Huh? You want me to play and tell you what I think? Did I, uh, get on your bad side or something? What is? This is a crazy scary. Just opening doors and walking down hallways is supposed to be pure terror. Sounds like some serious nightmare fuel. But it's a gift from you, so I'm gonna give it a shot. Ten minutes a day, or five, depending on how it goes. Five up? Oh god, Luke needs stacks. Now hold him back, let's find out what's inside. So, 10. Will 10 be enough? Oi, oi. Oh, wait, wait a minute. I wasn't able to finish the last one you gave me, so, uh. Oh, this one's not as scary. It's more about the thrill of combat than the chills of vomit. For real? Uh, okay then. It might make a nice change of pace. Thanks a bunch. What if this is supposed to be Ari? Ari was walk through doors and then became action games. No hooding back, let's find out what's inside. What? Wait a minute. Yeah. Nah, it looks like we'll have enough. Let's see how much we end up with. And he'll need four more. Whoops. Nice show, man. Back before it, I captured the world's attention. It was just a rural backwater, but then came all the investments and development aid. Everyone rushed to put the slimy, no, oh, slimy, the shiny building first. Plenty of fun to be had in a city like that. But fighting still king, as far as I'm concerned. Even a god shows up to watch. I don't have the fondest memory memories of the time there. But I'd love to travel the country when things cool up a bit. Just let loose and go wild in a tournament. 
Hey, maybe I'll ever run into you in the back, the bracket. <laughs> that happens. Fair warning, I ain't gonna going easy on ya. Haha. <laughs> No holding back, let's find out what's inside. Oi, oi. Okay, one more and then we'll get him drunk for a battle. Oi, oi. So from 60 to this, not bad. Okay. Have a beer. Okay, you're done. So, starting to see a path forward. You've been looking more confidently lately. Does feel like it, yeah? That's usually how it is when it comes down to changes in mindset. Heck, training you has changed me. Every time I teach you something, it gives me a chance to reflect. So thanks, gotta be honest, I set my expectations low when I first met you. But you've gotten something in you that I don't. You're like a technique sponge that's ridiculously flexible to match. Study under as many teachers as you can and expand your skills. Just remember to stay, say please and thank you. Got it? No, no. Hey, are you busy? Let's get some games in back at my place. <laughs> I'm loaded up on pizza, ice cream and snacks. If you've got any favorites, bring them with you. There'll be nothing holding us back. Plus. This game only just dropped today, so we'll be on equal footing. Yep, I'm talking about a fighting game. What? You think I'm just gonna stomp you? You'll be fine. Okay, sure, I've been playing fighters for over two decades. But neither of us have played this one before. Nothing more fun than exploring uncharted territories together. Ah, the stalkers! Ah, <laughs> what? What? Rubbish. Elia. To me, martial arts is like an extension of those fights from back on the playground. Yeah, br 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 br. yeah just let's, let's fight. Okay, let's see what you got, Luke. And what do I have in? I do not have a tatsu. Oh, that's I know why. Because I've got this. Oh! Gods. Actually, there's one thing I want to. Oh shit! He's uh, got two here. Man. Not, not what I want to do. I want to EX the. The extra spikes at the front, but I did the medium and heavy punch. Now I got the back one. Let's if I can do it right away off the bat. Dash this in twice to get in. I guess that's what you have to do against JP fighters. Dash in twice. He is stopping my exes. Boom! Ouch! No super. Go for the No ride. Go for the ride! I wanted the big one though. That's fine. These leather pants of mine reflect all the different. Colors of the world. I should like change it back out to my other pants. Okay. Uh, it's night time. We do not need to go this way. So the fast way. We want to go to Beat Square. Brum. Still got to load up all the assets so. I don't have the Rashad DLC, so I can't do it. We will wait until it becomes available for me. But we'll do all the normal things first. Then we're gonna do a 
go into its boss battle and see how that is. That one hasn't really taken off like wildfire. I don't think that too many people have tried to put that one out. Maybe like three people from what I've seen. No, we will see how hard it takes. When we get around to doing it, there's still plenty more Street Fighter to do. Okay, finally here. Uh. I die. Oh god, I think I'm going to need the controller for this. I need to activate it. No choice. We'll do Kimberly first, since she's just right here. Also, another thing I want to do, you, my friend, going for the ride. Ooh, he's got a, uh, a drink for us. Boom. Okay, look at that. Look at you. Go now and never return. Okay, you skip time. A present? Ah, oh, you are too kind. Oh, I know this one. A real emotional to a divorce. Or so they say. Anyways, I haven't seen it. Another prison? Yay, thanks so much. Oh yeah, I've heard it, it's real too, Jacob. Yeah, I tried watching a little bit of it actually. Definitely seemed like it was charging up some serious gut punches. Ah, thanks, I owe you one. Four more to go. Oof, shut. Doesn't matter. Take it. It's yours. Three. No, I don't need. Take it. Okay, let's talk. What? Ninja star mean? Take one part of ninja and add a heaping scoop of star and bam! Real complicated equation, right? One cool way of putting it would be to say it's like an attitude, a lifestyle. I want to help the weak, show the wor world. How Bunchiryu Ninja do things. With any luck, that'll inspire others to follow the same path. Just like I did when I saw Master Guy for the first time. What did I study in school? All sorts of stuff like computer. computer. computerational? Complexity theory, you know. Yeah, I hear you. In English, Einstein. About figuring out the hard certain things are to calculate. Some calculations take forever to figure out, but are trivial to check. Like how you can check the answer to prime factors with simple multiplication. When you think about stuff like that long enough, you realize something. Our world looks complicated and random, but there are simple, beautiful algorithms humming away happily behind it all. Studying that stuff made me feel like, like it sort of rubs off on me. 
Did I ever mention what I was doing when we first met at the Serum building? So I'm in the middle of an investigation. My uncle used to work for the Masters Foundation. That is, until he got caught up in an incident in Nature and died. He was a great guy who just wanted to do his job and he was shot. I couldn't believe it. When I looked into the details, I realized there was more going on than meets the eye. Siren isn't directly involved, but they're a contributor of sorts. I figured I could find out a clue or two by poking around. If there's one thing I'm sure of, it's that my uncle would have wanted the truth to come to light. A good picture of her here. That's it. Ninja skills come in two flavors, movement and techniques. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very nice. Let's rock. Alright, let's see how well we do against Kimberly. Let's see if we can finish these story things tonight. This is like take no damage. Ow. God, not even my flink can come out that far. I'm looking at the wrong bar. Ah. Eat this. Shit. I totally screwed that up. Boom. Going for the ride. Ugh. Didn't expect it to be that one out. Holding back. Ah, and she's running forward. That's a mistake. Counter. No sweep. Woo! That was the fight, Crackers. No uppercut. My second super. I think we've got tension kicks, right? You can take it off a cut. Hmm, not bad. Let's do this again sometime. Okay. What in the world did I just land on? I landed on the light post. The lamp post. Okay, let's go and search our gym. I should have went the back way. Define ninja star. So just to make sure we're on the same page, you got you get the whole ninja star concept, right? Uh, nah. It's like literally a ninja. That's a star. Not too complicated. What did you... Ah, what did you think you referred to a shuriken? Bzz. If that's what you seriously thought, that what I'm hearing is I haven't done a good enough job explaining it. So, a radiant star... Ninja star twinkles in the heavens. I am... I am duty bound to pursue its glow. Mm. Ninjutsu. I've taught you plenty up to this point. It's most of it sticking to you. I'm a ninja star. There is yet that loots me. OMG. Oh, I'm well aware. All I've taught you is what I'm capable of performing myself after all. Real deal, Bushin Ryu is on a whole other level. Let's strive towards that ninja truth together. Gonna you got mail me again? Or we finish? Shall we? What? Where'd the guy go? I thought that guy like looked like Yashiro. Yeah, we finish.
We've done Trunas, she's not here anyways. Okay, here we go, Jamie. Let's gift you. Whoa, you giving this to me? Hmm, a sticker for the Manto shop? I like Manto just fine. Doesn't mean I have to slap stickers on the stuff. On the stuff on everything. Lies. You love it. Present. Damn, you must have read my mind. Come to think of it, this nerdy girl I ran into. She had the same sticker on her laptop. I'll hang on to this thanks. I'm gonna think of game. Two more! Two more! One more to go! Alright! Here's Max! My master and grandma hand picks the ingredients used in our medicinal drink from the mountains. Stuff like herbs, reishi, mushrooms, ginseng, the taste is, well, you know already, but hey, for real though, it's not like I can fight without it or anything. It's mostly just health with key control. I could skip it and fight just fine if I felt like it. No sweat. But man, when it matters most, it's like an oasis in the desert. Story time. This one's all about when I was just starting out. I think it's the... I think it was around when I was in middle school. Maybe before anyway. Hanging around at home sucked. Going to school was boring. So I hung out with other kids like me and got into brawls on the back streets. This was before I learned Kempo. But I was fearless, fearlessly stupid anyway. One time I got in over my head, messed with someone who turned out to be part of the real deal criminal underworld. I was caught instantly, and they beat the ever-loving crap out of me. They gave me two options, become one of their underlings or die. So I told them I don't work for nobody, kill me if I, uh, kill me, see if I care. They were seriously, they were serious and I, so was I, I was ready to die, no joke. That's when the cavalry arrived, Yun and Yang, peacekeepers, extraordinaire, everyone knew these guys, they were legends. The two of them have a quick chat with my captors. Then they looked at me, all bruised and bloodied, sucked me in the face and dragged my busted body out there. Talk about a wake up call. From that moment on, I wanted to be like them, like the twin dragons. Yeah, not the double dragons. I told you my grandma taught me everything I know about martial arts, right? I don't get to visit her very often, since she lives in the mountains, but I had a chance to say hi the other day. She was dressed to the nines, man. And the cool thing was, she got me an outfit too. We trained all day, dressed in fighting garb. I felt like even more of a god than usual. All the founders of my fighting stuff, the old hermit and the whatnot, my grandma was probably showing me off to all of them. Front row seats in the clouds and cheering us up. And hey, you know what? Once you get good enough, it'll be my turn to show you off to them. Be sure to puff out your chest and look proud for me, got it? Okay, so this weird juice, my. Stell uses is kind of like an energy drink. 
If you're not a drunken boxer, drinking will only give you one hell of a nosebleed. You can treat yourself a round or two. You know what I'm talking about, right? Unhop. Okay, let's go, Jamie. Give me some EXP. This rock L, the heavians. Uh, the other attacks. Oh. I'll do it cheaply. Oh, beats me out. But you can double up the, the uppercuts. That's fine. Oh no! Didn't get any yoga flames. That sucks. Eat the cell. I just want to see her go like poof. Like the cartoons. Like the sticky sooner in a pal point. Don't do that. Don't listen to what I'm saying. I'm telling you better advice. Don't stick your hand in a pal point. Very electrifying. Oh, misses. Ah. Going over the top. Ooh. Is he on it? Oh wow, he can juggle it. Dang, I'm the one losing. Oh wow, landed. the easy way out. Alright, that takes Jamie. Everyone is cleared in Metro City. Not bad at all. Looking clean out there. Okay. Hey, Jamie's chick moves. More poses. Actually, wait a minute. Am I going to get the messages? Once I jump down, it will. Come on. I know you want to talk to me. Or is it, will it pop up? If I go into it? If not, we'll take the trip. Ah, uh, let's take the trip. He's not going to talk. Okay. So, I was thinking. Do we go down the list and go take a trip to... Kami? No. You know, we don't have Kami's things yet. Let's go. Who did we get? We've done uh, Uber JP stuff. We've done Jamie. We've done Honda. Gal needs Nato. We know her. We got Cammy's. Let's do Cammy. We do. We got her jelly deals. That's what I'm thinking. And we can do Lily. We'll do Lily next after this one. I wouldn't have saved Kemi more to last, but that's fine. Eve needs wooden bears. He sold in his place. What sells in Kemi's place, though? Oops. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Let's go. Talk. Stand up. Let us buy. These are nothing. I don't think anyone needs double KO gum. And that's the truth. No one needs it. 
Just double chicken. Yeah, no one needs it. So, nothing to buy in this place. Let's go talk to Kemi. You want to give me something? Let's see it then. Okay, where is your jelly deals? The 12 of them. Eels? They're certainly nutritious. It's just the texture is so. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Well, I ate them. Don't ask me for a review. She gives it a five bob. You want to give me something? Let's see it then. Eels. A fine feast for a cat, I imagine. Only in this case. They being flavored, which means it's up to me to choke on uh, choke them down. Uh The eels have been disposed of. I can only hope you learn something from witnessing this act. <laughs> Forcing the eels down her throat. How funny. Jory needs the wrenches. Oh, we've got to find out where we can get some wrenches for her. Must be like killing for a fight. I'm trying to feel feeding her all the stuff. Want to give me more of these eels? God damn! Give me something better. Okay, hell. Far are we up? Two more. One more, and something small. Or we can give them more. Let's give you some Psycho Charge. Actually, does anyone use Psycho Charge? No one uses Psycho Charge. Let's, let's turn it into old Kami. Is this a piece of evidence? Wait, you want me to use it? Well, how about that? Thanks. Okay, she's maxed out. Master is a funny word, all too different from instructor, to be sure. i worked as an instructor before, providing guidance to other op operatives. Besides standard combat training, knife throwing and horseback riding are in my areas of expertise as well. That's right. Horseback riding, through fe forests, I was going to say through fences, over rivers and across tr uh, trackless wilderness. Mounted police are hardly an uncommon sight on the streets of London, you know. More importantly, horses are noble, strong, and beautiful. They possess an appeal entirely dissimilar from that of cats. They don't look at me like that. My feeling for cats remain unshaken. I've always enjoyed teaching others how to ride horses, though. Perhaps I could even teach you, given the opportunity. Doesn't she look like she comes from... Ah, uh, shit, what's it called? I don't remember what the show is. Totally Spies! <laughs> looks like, uh, what's her name? I can't remember what her name is. You're really starting, starting to come onto your own. 
not quite at the level Delta Red requires, but well, I suppose I might as well tell you. You know of Siren, right? The robotic business is booming. They even have a new building under construction. How would you respond if I told you they were a threat? Heh. <laughs> Just so, Siren is a global organi organized blue chip company. They're nothing on their, their records. No incidents, no past investigations, all reveal the company to be above board. But I can't help but think something is amiss here. That Siren has some kind of connection to Shadowloo. I'm lucky to be working with someone like yourself, someone who delves into Metro City's shady underbelly. But you don't want to use those skills to fish for intel. You want to take on the world, correct? By all means, return to your journey, but I'd like to maintain this relationship for cooperation we built. Whatever you end up, I'll always be but a message away. Vantage inhabitants do reach out. Hey. Do you know how Shadowloo was able to become such a massive criminal organization? Military technology and Bison's leadership and charisma. Those are results. I'm talking about the cause. Bison's psycho power was at the heart of it all. A demonic power that could bend others to his will or destroy them. We were called dolls. Soldiers, subservient to a bison's will, was to commit unspeakable atrocities. Shadowloo might have fallen, but I have no doubt that many former dolls are still struggling with the effects of that curse. I think of all of them as my sisters, and I'll do whatever I can to save them all. Just as I found a home for myself in Delta Red, my wish is that they all get the chance to lead their own lives. Ah. So, it's already too late for one of them. All we can do for her now is live on and make sure she remembers. Where is Julie? Oh, she's on the bottom right. Okay, it's my time. Come to think of it, I don't hear from you terribly often. Um, I mean, it's not that there's anything wrong with that. No, news is good news after all, right? Go on then, show me the skills you've owned in the fires of live combat. <laughs> yeah, here's to my ears. Alright, let's beat her out. I'm going for that uppercut. Whoops, or maybe I'm not. Oh, Smidel! We all know that's what you came to see. Look at this cheap, super cheap, <laughs> and that's what I get. Oh, stop the! Give a sec. Give a sec. I gotta get hit. Okay, here we go. Let's rock. Don't settle. Own your skills further in combat. And just checking one more. Things proceeding well, or do you find yourself? Yeah. Yeah, we're good to leave. It's lovely time. Jamie didn't send us any messages, which is pretty interesting. Yes, he's got nothing to say. We've been talking to Lily a bit, so she might not have too much. 
Tour. Okay, this is gonna be Kemi, right? State of mind. Greetings. Are you feeling well? Calling me in for active service? Is this another test? I wanted this another test. No, that was not my intent. I simply want to ask you personally, and would I would ask what you express your feelings via sticker. Boom, girl. Goodbye. <laughs> emergency. We have an emergency on our hands. I made contact with a hostile. Target is a dog. Smaller breed. Please advise. Uh, I'll freak your hand. Deploy flanking tactics. Oh, for your hand. <laughs> my, my hand? Are you daft? Regardless, I was unsuccessful. I closed. Ah! I closed this distance as best I could, but it fled down the yellow way. But I'm. But not before turning and looking at me. A behavioral pattern similar to that of a cat. It was quite cute, I'll admit. Okay. Let's see, Mr. Merchant. Actually. Okay, yes. Let's see, Mr. Merchant. What do you have for me? Anything to buy? Ooh, items. Cookbook! This is supposed to be for Ken. Ooh, I'm gonna buy two. Ooh, even though we already did max out Ken already with random shit. It's all fine. You're giving me. You're giving this to me? Oh, much obligated. She wants celery chips. Why not? If you ever had the really crunchy celery chips, they're actually pretty good. I think they were broccoli chips, to be honest. They were like dried out and they were super damn well crunchy. And they're expensive. Uh, what, uh, what'd you get me? Snacks? Wow, celery? I had no idea they made stuff like this. I love celery. There's no bit of snack to share with wild bunnies every now and then. I bet they're gonna love these. Thanks so much. Okay, take it, take it off my hands. Celery snacks, you know I can't say no to these. Apparently a lot of kids in the city don't like celery, I wonder why. This, it's so good, those kids don't know what they're missing. Thanks as always, oh, this is so exciting. Celery snacks, yeah, whatever. Bring me the beef. I don't need the healthy stuff. <laughs> Two more to go. Here you go. Yuki Moore is a good guy. He brought me sushi and steak. <laughs> this is what this reminds me of. <laughs> Alright, she's 100%. Let's go. Ever heard of power spots? Apparently, they're places where energy gathers, unseen to the naked eye. Tall mountains, colossal trees, funky looking rocks, those kind of things. I visit a bunch of places like that during my travels. In Japan, at a temple dedicated to the gods, flowers bloomed in tranquil beauty. There's beneath the trees was a fighter standing amidst the silence. No doubt about it, that place was positively swimming with spirits. The spirits have always guided me like that during my travels. And they still do. Their voices guide me as I continue my journey. I know I've still got lots of incredible encounters waiting for me out there. 
Do you enjoy fighting? If so, it may not be possible for you to become a true warrior. A warrior must wait until the very last moment to fight, only doing so as an absolute last resort. To choose combat is to risk placing the lives of many in danger. That includes you, your allies, and loved ones, and your opponents as well. You must never let yourself get accustomed to death, killing and bloodshed. And if you see someone on the brink of succumbing, it's a warrior's job to stop them from fighting. Tricky stuff, right? I'm still getting my hand on it myself. Ever since I was little, people have told me I'm special. I can hear the voice of the spirits clearly and imbue myself with their power. The history of my tribe speaks to only one other person who could do the same. The great founder of the Thunderfoot tribe itself. But to tell you the truth, none of that really matters much to me. Being the reincarnation of some great ancestor, having the power of Tono no Ikoni? If I didn't have any of that, who would I be? I'm still figuring that out. Much like you. Much like everyone, probably. Nobody truly knows who they are. That's why we travel the world. <laughs> yep, I'm just a simple traveler. We all are. Do you ever have nightmares? I get them from time to time. In these nightmares, I'm a little older and I face my face looks super scary. Tono Ikono, Ikonoi, I don't know why I can't say it this time, speaks to me in the spooky voice too. I guess that's nightmares for you. So, you wanna fight? I quite don't remember if we're across the Julie picture. Is it only in like story mode or something? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. That's not a blanket ball. Evades me. Doesn't come out with the uppercut. Okay. Alright. Let's go. Oh. Alright. Gets me with her own command grab. Lovely. She, she can fly over the top. She gets me with her command grab. No, it's a standard grab. Gonna get beaten out. Oh, no five ball. Okay, I'm safe. Oh. I, 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 thank God. <laughs> oh, down to the wire. Not liking it. Okay, we gotta get this. Take this girl for a ride. Ah, uh, safe. This is safe. Bra. I can't get with the level three. Damn. Ah uh, no, I spent. Excellent. That's fine. I can. Oh shit! I can live with it. I get. I'll take the damage. Oh, I gotta take. Okay, okay there we go. Chai. Alright. There we go. Just going for the ride. Okay. 
That was one heck of a fight. Okay, that's it. Leveled up. 94. Alright, I don't want to talk to you. Okay, we finished. Alright, that is the end for Lily. I think we will take a trip. I think we're gonna take a trip to Russia first. Let's see Geek. Let's see, uh, I think we're gonna buy a few beers for this guy. I, but I've never seen the merchant in this place. It must be on like the far left. Hey, where is he? Here we go. Okay. Let us talk. One thing. Do I ever go to his, his store? He's got nothing, literally. Okay. So. We have zero. Uh, uh, we probably need eight. Because I'm rich, I'll buy ten. My money is going downhill. And also, while we are here. While we are here. I haven't actually checked my stats out. Okay, so we have three. It's gonna do us great. Oh, I got a sh I got Shinko. Why do I have Shinko Hadouken? No, I don't. I got a. Oh, Ko Ko Sen. I want to know, uh, I guess, I want to know what this thing is. A present for me? Let's see here. Where is your... Oh, we got seven autos, nice. Uh, where is your bear? Where's your wooden bear? It's right at the bottom. He goes to the bottom of the list. A bear? Hmm, it's been long since. That frigid battle to the death. Every second chiseled into my muscles, just like this figure. I cannot. I can't wait to put it on the windowsill. Ooh, she is. He's not too far away. Another gift? How dutiful are you? A bear, hmm. It's been long. T long it's been since that. Oh, it's not gonna say the same thing. No different. Another gift? Yes. Three more to go. Or should we give him a beer? Why not? Oh god. Are you aware of the fighter called Rainbow Pika? She's a seeker of well muscle artistry like yourself. She began training under me before you, in fact. That makes her your elder sister in training. She's a top fighter and an active wrestler, no less. Feels like only yesterday she stepped into the ring for the first time. No, she is big enough to be the main event. She has got great instincts like you, and she has such such zeal, such passion, passion for wrestling. Uh, it brings a tear to my eyes. Uh, forgive me, I get a little carried away. In any case, I'd like to see you and her face off sometime. Yeah, small gifts for you. Take it. I think I accidentally gave you the bear, but I was supposed to give you the drink. Okay, it's talk time. Tell me, have you thrown a Hadouken before? Yes, plenty of times. 
It is not my place to forbid such techniques, of course, but just standing back and hurling projectiles, you could say it ru runs counters to my aesthetic sensibilities. Ryu, Gal, everyone. Always they're throwing those damn projectiles. <laughs> the well strategy, of course. And were are you to use them, I should I could open a world of new possibilities. Bah, what am I saying? The only projectiles I need are the opponents I grab and throw. That's how I fight, and I always fight. For me to even contemplate such hearsay, I clearly am neglecting my trainings. Today I will do five thousand squats. You keep coming to see me, yes? You must be a very passionate wrestling fan. I train to perform moves and withstand them. Your muscles no longer shriek from pain of training, but joy. As your muscles cultivate strength, however, you must never forgive, forget to give them proper rest. Fail to re relieve the tension in your tangled tendons, and your body might come apart at the seams. If you think that oh that's a waste of time, then spend it building the muscles in your head instead. And no, I don't mean headbutts. You could try reading books, for instance. This might come as a surprise to you, but I read 300 books a year. Jesus! Right then, today we're going to the local library. One of my favorite places. I have feelings you'll quickly take a liking to it as well. Haha, <laughs> jeez! I've never seen this geek before. Business geek. You're on some kind of journey, you? yes? It doesn't seem to be simple tourism. Ah, it is a journey to become stronger. Excellent, that doesn't sound so different to a pro wrestler going on tour. Don't overlook any place during your travels. You wouldn't believe the caliber of fighters you'll find in this world. But have you, your world travels taught you? It's time for those muscles to answer. Yes. Uh, let's see. Okay, I can just flame this guy to death if I truly wanted to. Oh, look at this, Geef. Lots of projectiles for you. I'm the most dirtiest tactician ever. Oh, until he gets too close, that is. But when he gets too close, blah, blah. I, blah. That's what I'm going for. Well, when you get too close, and then I got my own spinning goddamn pyro if I came out, and you can see the air grab out. And I got one too! That causes way more damage. Let's rock this! Boom! Let's jump up. Uh oh. Oh, he doesn't have another super. He can't grab me. Whoa. Board punch. Oh, grabs my machine gun. Uppercut. That's fine. Ah. Whoa. Whoa. With a spinning heel kick. Bra. Oh, sorry. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, do we go another round? Do we go another round? Oh shit, if I don't be careful, we will be going another round. Alright, let's see. I was looking for the jump in. That's fine. No games. Whoa. Takes me up for an EX. Spine Buster. Ah, crossover. Body Slam. Oh, he's gonna rip out the level one. Hey. Okay, not that bad. Oh, oh, you nasty boy. 
Okay. Okay. Oh, we did. Oh, we did. Oh, two counter moves. Well, the underwear. Dang. Two counters. Can we pull that off? Oh no, I can't. E, you're too strong. Shite. We're all jumping around. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, these will get mighty dangerous. Super cheap. Super cheap. There was nothing finer than a clash of immaculate own muscles. Until next time. Okay. Well. We can't see Sims at the moment. Because Sims requires instant curry, which we don't have. We need to go to Nashop for that, but for the time being, well, let's go see Manon. What does Marissa need? Marissa, oh nice. Marissa needs cold tomato soup, which we buy in France. Awesome. This works out well. We'll go see Marissa next. And then we can also go to Asia and get some instant curry for Sims. And then I think where do we get the rest the wrenches for jewelry? The wrenches is at India. We Oh by five. I'm running out of money. <laughs> running out of money, dang it. Okay. What's this? You have a prison for me? You get to we got one wrench. We got two instant curries. Mm. She wants this. I'm glad to see you have an interest in learning about French culture. I recommend visiting the source of production firsthand. You should prove quite enriching. She needs a bit. Yeah, see, what will it be this time, I wonder? Studying French code, yes. Merci beaucoup. Yes, you are welcome too. One more? Two more. I'll give her all this fine wine. And then I'll give her like a beer. <laughs> you get to have the, the greatest fine wine ever. Ah, so this is your pick, is it? I think I under understand you a little bitter now. No, you do not. Okay. You know, training is all well and good, but do you have a goal in mind? I know you're dealing with circumstances of your own, but athletes should settle clear goals for themselves and entering a tournament or winning a medal, for example, that makes every day, every minute, every second of training extra meaningful. Concentrate, focus, on, uh, focus your awareness, drill deep down, do so, and a brand new you awaits. 
that's how I found victory at the World Ultra Judo Championship. No, oh, I thought that was Baymon for a moment. It's a very prestigious competition, yes, but that's not important. I accomplished the goals I set for myself and proved my strength. That's what matters. Still, I was on cloud nine when I won. It feels felt like the audience would never stop applauding. It made me so happy I decided to make my victory medal into an accessory. My father and brother made quite the fuss about it, but I don't care, it's my medal. I'm sure you'll get to experience a similar excitement in the not so distant future. Be sure to show me your medal when you do. I'll design something truly stunning for you. Do you have a second? It's about something I'm planning for tomorrow. I'm quitting judo. I'll, it'll be au revoir forever. Goodness, you reacted exactly how as I expected. Sorry, it was a bad joke. I tried imagining what my life would be like if I never learned judo. Right, I probably would have become a model. I do love attention after all. But I doubt that would have been enough to satisfy me. I want to show the world who I really am. So I think I would have pursued ballet as a form of physical expression. And I doubt I would have ever met you. Or knowing you. Perhaps you would have made your way to ballet stage in search of more moves to learn. <laughs> Even if it comes to that, you'll have nothing to fear. Just like back then, I'd, l I'd let you play the ultimate supporting role. That's my job as leading lady after all. Okay. Autumn will soon be here at Chetan's Harvesting Season. We save the grill in Chetan's. Yes, we've read this before. Let's fight! Let's go! And then it will be off to Marissa. Jumping up! She doesn't want to go up because I got an air grab for you. Oof. You like grabs? I got grabs! Boom. Oh, goes over the top. Not exactly what I'm looking for. There's my blanket ball. Goes in. Whoa. I'm to get the machine gun up, but it's so slow. Machine gun up uh, comes out slow. Yeah, I need to use the light version. I try to rip that off on the bat. Mistakes. She doesn't capitalize. There's a few anime I need to watch as well. I've got Bucky to watch and I've also got a record of Ragnarok. So, those are the two few things that I need to catch up on. Let's rock! Boom! No boom! Take it off the gun. Constellation Prize. Hey, <laughs> hey, well, that was a, a nice change of pace. Okay. You are finished, right? Okay, let's go. Off to Rome. Palacio. Italy. Let's see if there's anything. Italy has rubber duckies for E Honda, which has already been done. So we're gonna go to. We're gonna go to see Gal next. We have mail. Metro City. I am not so familiar with Metro City. To me, it seems like the city with a rather 
rugged flavor. How do you feel about it as a travel destination? Thumbs up. You'll never get bored. Thumbs down. It's a it's a crime hidden hellscape. Oh my. I've heard it has been cleaned up. A complete reversal from what it was what it once was. Sounds like I was almost fooled. I do suppose it is a haven for street fighters after all. I appreciate your honesty, Messi. Okay. We go again. Grant me strength. My passion for fighting grows by the day. I wish to be more well known for my abilities as a martial artist. On that note, I would like your opinion on something. I'm looking for a ring name of sorts. Something that sounds strong. The Virtuous Swan. The Swan Supernova. Swan Supernova it is. A supernova. It calls to mind something glittering and radiant. Yes. But after a brief, brilliant explosion, all that remains is stardust. I had a friend who vanished from the world of fashion in much the same way, but you're absolutely right. I managed to cultivate an image as a swan of the runway. It was all I had at first, just a white bird with little else to her name. My goal now is to show that this one can fight with power and grace. Uh, I just can't wait to hear what they end up calling me in the ring. Okay. Uh, okay. That's for it. Let's see him. Right. You got the rubber duckies. You got anything else? You got nothing else but their 3850. Okay, we don't need to buy those. Oh, a gift, a gift for me. Uh, you need the tomato soup. Cool soup, huh? A soup where I come from is thick, rich, and piping hot. But when I think of food, that is what I tend to think of. Couldn't it hurt to try cooling down my palate from time to time, though. Ugh, she's far away. Ah, you really don't have to do this. Or do all this, you know. Yes, I do. Oh, soup. I tried it out the other day, and it chilled my entire body. Left my stomach feeling a bit empty and wanting. You. Why, thank you. I re really appreciate it. You. If we ever run out of cold soup, well, stock you up on beer. Three more? And I only got two more. You know what? I might keep... Ah shit. Press the wrong button. When I stand in the Colosseo like this and close my eyes, I swear I cannot hear the roar of an ancient crowd. They cheer on gladiators pitted against each other to the death. A barbaric spectacle you say, huh? Even I can't deny that. Even so. The warriors here fought with their strength on the line, their fighting spirits and pride pushing them forward. It's almost like I can see a glimmer of their radiance in the dark. It's almost overwhelming. You. Let's see, let's see. Take. Take this. How lovely. I'll make sure to take good care of it. How much? Here too? Ah, after training or a lively match, the soul cries out for delicious food. I never complain about a thick cut of meat. But I don't count out a good stew either. Ever heard Oso Buko? Veal shank braised with white wine and broth? My nonna had a recipe that used oranges. Absolutely perf perfection. Pairs better with wine than anything else on the planet. Ah, uh, how cruel. Just talking about it is making a waterfall of my mouth. 
I may have to call off training for the day. You. Okay. Let's give you. Take this. Is it gonna give you two only? Yes. You. Take. Take some beer. Two more to go. I usually like to keep like one of every item. Even though there's no real need to keep one of every item. Okay. Just max out. The other day I met up with my nonna. She is skilled with her hands, just like I am. She made me a dress more beautiful than any I've seen. That's right, my wedding dress. She wants to live to see the day I walk down the aisle wearing it. I hadn't given so much as a thought to the idea of marriage. But if I'll, it'll make my nonna happy, I might as well consider it. Who I marry? I don't have any candidate at the moment. Man, woman, I don't really care who it is to be honest. So long as we can savor life's sweet beauty together. That's what truly matters. Dang! Instead of fretting about your progress, focus on training instead. Aside from that, eat well, crap well, and whatever. Let's fight! Okay, let's see how she's gonna. She's jumping up. She's gonna jump up, right? Craps! Oh! Counters. I was like, looking for that post grab. I know she likes to jump up second. One. Ah, oh, bra. Beats me out. Oh, that's not what I'm looking for. Jump up. There we go. Okay, let's see if we can pull her up again. Ah, one now. No, she'll. Ah, oh, bra. It's gonna go for the jump. Somehow ends up getting the sweep. Okay, let's see if we can roll her. Oh, I just got stepped in the face. How does she play against this? Oh god. Can't save this. This tactical mind. Oh. Ow, ow, ow. Okay, okay, okay. Danger, danger, danger. I'll take the loss. I'm I'm gonna have to. <laughs> no, I do not feel good. No, thank you. Oh, no jumping. Oh. Oh, not coming out. Mrs. Grab! Get back body dropped! Dang! Oh, don't die! Ah, Shibata! I'm trying to go for the big one. That's fine! Wahahaha, oh, you really sucked it to me! Hey! Okay. Alright, next up! Let us go to Guile. Yeah, yeah, babies. Who's over to do Blanca? Okay, this guy needs Nato. I don't think that there's anything at the airbase we need to buy. We'll see what the airbase has. Okay, where is this guy?
He has Mega Man Calendar. Does anyone want the Mega Man Calendar? No one wants the calendar. And that's about it. Okay, God. Another gift? I'm flattered, but you really shouldn't have. Oh, shh! Wrong one. Huh. Nice choice. I'll be sure to hold on to this. Wrong item. One up. Too fast on the trigger. Okay, you need the Nato for some odd reason. You know, you reminded me of another martial artist. Next time we fight, I'll have a feeling you'll be at their level. The gift is appreciated too, thanks. What's this? You're showing me a challenge, are you? Fine by me. I'll repay the favor the next time we spot. I don't think we got enough Nato, do we? Maybe. You know the name of this aircraft carrier? Byron Taylor, Taylor named after the recent retired politician. It's also the name of his son, Air Force General Taylor, who led the operation to destroy Shadowloop. Really? Earned him a medal. And now the media is calling him the greatest general of the modern era. He retired from the military after that and became a politician following in his father's footsteps. <laughs> Hell of a car career. As one of his former men, I can't help but admire the guy. But I have to admit, I've got some reservations about the way the operation was handled. First, they kept pumping the brakes every step of the way. It's a miracle the operation succeeded at all. Second, we let the goons get away. We took out their base and satellites, but the only human target we hit was Bison. It was a victory of sorts, but we barely dented their personal supplies and funding. I guess hindsight's 2020. That's why I accept the job on the carrier. General Taylor trained me, so they figured I'd pass on his spirit of service to the crew. Heh, I hope I don't end up embarrassing myself down the line. Okay. How much? <laughs> I give her, you know, you really don't have to keep doing this. Let's give you a fighter's magazine. Heh, <laughs> nice choice. I'll be sure to, to hold on to this. How many? One up. Bra. They're hard. Bargain. How about a beer? Two up. You can get a lot of beers in Nashell. Ah, you've definitely improved. There aren't many activities so active soldiers out there with your grasswork technique. That's bound to come in handy f for you down the road. Anyway, when I first met you, I was torn. Should I embrace change as a soldier or resist? Well, today I have my answer. I pour my heart and soul into hand-to-hand -hand combat. I'm passing that passion to you. The fight's not gonna be an easy one. It's a bloodbath in there. And hot as hell to boot. A far, car, uh, a far cry from the battle I'm, I'm going to be overseeing. I'll be commanding unarmed weapons, but the soldiers involved still bleed. They need protecting, uh, uh, protecting all the same. Adapt to any situation, never fear change. That's what it's meant to be a pro. And one more? One more. You have take this. Hey, 
Nice choice. I'll be sure to hold on to this. You really want that? Charlie died, not once, but twice. The first time he had Bison dead to rights, then his backup betrayed him, plunging him into a waterfall. They never found his body. He went MIA, but was officially recognized as killed in action. But a certain organization brought him back from the brink of death. The details remain shrouded in mystery. I was able to see him once more, however briefly. And this time, he had the ability to neutralize Psycho Power. He used every ounce of strength to chase down Bison again, and this time he entrusted Ryu to put him away for good. When Charlie died a second time, I was there to watch him go. Ryu and Chun-Li saw him off too. He proved his bravery, staying true to his ideals of righteousness to the very end. And when I visited his grave sometimes, my friends are there to see him too. He is forever by our side. Okay. Watch your opponents and patiently analyze their moves. If you find this string, the strike's terrifying. Yay. Let's go. Let's go. Get the show on Rogue Isle. Oh, I'll stop with a kit. That's not what I'm looking for. Ah, stops the man stopping the upcuts. Ah, old school aisle. I got something for you. Maybe I don't. Ouch. Here we go. Boom. 360. Nice old. Should I abuse that one? Oh, go 360. Jumping up. I can bypass that. Oh, come in. Yay. What, what, what should we open up with? Let's go. Boom works. Oh, skips. I can't do anything with that. Oh, no, wake up. Overhead kick. Interesting. No block. Grab. It's fine, okay. Boom! No, no boom. Let's try it. We got it. Yeah, you certainly improved. Okay. What's your opponent? Man. Okay, he's done. So, um... Who do we go for next? We need to get items from... Actually, no, let's do, let's do Blanca. Let's get Blanca out of the way. We gotta get the wrenches from India. We gotta get the curry from Nashel. So this is gonna be a bit back and forth between these two. Brazil has nothing. But we gotta give the fake Blanca dolls to Blanca. And I don't think I've got that many. We'll spam me with other stuff. Where's the motion motions over here? What do you have for me? You need to get the fake Blanca dolls from a uh, Nashell. Standard ones. We've got 27 of these guys. Bet you he don't want them. Wooden fork carving. You don't need this as well. 
You need this one for DJ. Let me check something. Fake coffin? No one wants it. No one wants it. Okay. Alright. Let's see. Let's talk to Blanco. Ah! Oh, oh no, 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 no. Sensitive controller. Oh, this is for me. So, you want the egg version. We got 10 of them, nice. This is a blanket chain doll. Something seems different. Whoa, it's handmade. This is a. They're giving me warm fuzzies. Thank you so much. Oh, oh. It's still at the bottom. Well, another present. You get these knockoff dolls in Nashell from fighting people. A handmade blanket doll, chain doll. Whoever made this must have really put their heart into it. You made my day. You just made my day. Yes. Blanco's original alpha looks way better than this one. I've seen people playing with the the OG alpha. With just the the brown shorts. Two more to go. Okay, Maxell. Oh, movies. Yes, I love movies. If I had a movie, everyone would know about me. I'd be popular for sure. I was showing a movie person around this one time, and they said I was practically made for the big screen. You'd be perfect as a big bad monster that kidnaps damsels in distress. <laughs> Who is the girl? It looks like Anita. Oh, oh, something tells me I might be in the movie someday. Am I okay with playing the role of monster? Pfft. I'll let you know. I'll let you in on a secret. The movies are made up. They're not real. I know I'm not really a big scary monster. Movies are make believe. That's what makes them fun. You want to be strong? That's your dream? My dream, I want to make Mama happy and live happily, I think. Mama says she's happy just having me around. He says it's okay if I don't become popular or famous. It, does that mean my dreams come true? Do I not have to worry about getting any stronger? Nah, I think I'm, abs I'm thinking about this wrong. If I stop trying to become strong, I'll get weak. I won't be able to protect my dream. I just have to keep getting stronger. Think. Thanks, your dream really got me thinking about what I'm trying to accomplish. Oh, oh, having students really is great. Greyhead Bison. Look at Geef. Oh, this is DBZ. Oh my god, I, didn't, I just realized it. How funky. Hey, okay. So, like. Things that live in the jungle. Yes. Let's go. Let's go, Blanca. Let's see what you can do. If I jump in the air, will you anti air me? Will you... No, you will not anti air me. Ow. Ow. Jumps in. Oh, bra. Oof. 
fry you, green bean. Who for the pounce? Oh. Oh! Sets me up! Boom! You're going for the drive. Going for the uppercut? Nothing. Oh, nothing came out. Whoops, I hit the wrong button. I slid it across. Landed! <laughs> Whoa, that was one wall test of strength. Ah, how does, how does that? Attack on you. Okay, for train, or do you just want to see Blanket Chat? Alright, I'm going to go to Nashell. Let's go get that curry, and then we're going to take a trip back to Sims. Oh, actually, this is a good question. Where exactly is the curry? Which shop? There's two shops. Uh, we'll do Sims. And then we'll get the wrenches at Sims, then we'll fly back to Nashell, do jury, and then do JP, and I think that ends the wall tour for us for the time being. Ah, Nashell's gonna take a bit of time to load up. Let's go down the list. Blank has been done. Kang has been done. Oh, good. Chun Li has been done. DJ has been done. Dalsim has not been done. Honda has been done. Girl has been done. Jamie has been done. JP has been done. Jury has not been done. Ken has been done. Kim Lee has been done. Lily has been done. Luke has been done. Menon has been done. Marissa has been done. Ryu has been done. And Zangief has been done. So there's literally three more to go. Nice. Nice old. Okay. Do you have the curry, mister? He sure does. Awesome. Let's just buy six. I don't have enough money. No, I'm pressing on the wrong thing. Okay, I think that should be fun. You know what? There. Next thing is no. I'm I'm all good. We are all good. Do I want it to? I want to do something. I want to check something out. Let's want to quick check, quick check. Let's see what the other shop has. Awesome. Let's up. Hi, hi. Let's see. Misses, what do you have? She's got the can herrings for Chun Li. There you go. So you, you want Chun Li? You come to this girl. Also, she's got uh, this small Blanca Chan doll, which is the the maid one. So you can give these to Blanca. You can fight her for it. E. All right, off to Sims first. So Sims. So once we do Sims, we get the, uh, we'll do the we'll get the wrenches, we'll do Sims, and we'll, we fly back to Nashell. Then we'll do jury, JP, and finished. Then you guys are gonna say, oh, you still gotta do Rashid, Rashad, Rashido, no Rashid. I do not have Rashid. That's the wait. Where is the guy? There he is. Go bargains, you go bargains. Yes, please. Have the wrenches on special. Oh my god. So expensive. 
I'll take eight. Woof. Bye bye money. Okay, that's all good. We don't need it. We've got everything we need. The first did not suffer. Uh, you need instant curry. Yeah, I gave you a few. What? Manner of ultra mild curry? A curry that is mild, I suppose. That's whatever form it takes. Curry remains curry. Which leaves me with but one option to consume it. Pardon me a moment, will you? Nom 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 nom. Another, uh, another yoga miracle. This is. I I thank you for the gift. Ooh. A gift. What is this? Encountering such a mild flavor was a shock indeed. But all things are in con constant state of flux. It tastes included. Now then, allow me to sample this. Well, Sims is only skin and bone. He must be enjoying this. Hmm. I I sense the yoga miracle. I I thank you for the gift. Yeah, I might do a bit of a funny afterwards. Let's see how many coppers and gold and silvers we've got to sell. Let's see how much I've actually accumulated through the grinding. Two more in a bit. Ninety-nine. You know what goes down with a good bowl of curry? A lukewarm beer. This is quite the oddity. But perhaps this is simply another form of Agnes guidance. Let's get him drunk. Cause we going to fight soon. I was doing some house cleaning the other day. As I admired the family photos lining the shelves, memories of my past stirred. I met my wife Sally in Mumbai. She was a student at the yoga school I had opened there. She was a brilliant coach. She still is. I send data, data, and I often find ourselves over eating. Speaking of data, he is currently studying diligently to become a doctor. He can stretch his limbs just as I can, but he has been reluctant to do so of late. He says it is weird. I suddenly speak of my family. Perhaps it was seeking those photos that inspired me. Or perhaps. Uh, <laughs> what am I saying? Or perhaps it was speaking to you. <laughs> Whenever the case, I thank you for lending an ear. Let us resume your training, shall we? Any tongue tied? I discovered a new form of yoga recently. <laughs> a home. A new. Frontier of Yoga. Ready. Begin by putting both hands on the ground, then performing three and a half twists. Mm -hmm. Is something the matter? You look baffled. 
This cannot be achieved by thinking with your head. Embrace the power of the sun. Submit yourself to the flow. First, put both hands on the ground and twist your body three and a half times. Hmm, we're not quite there yet. I trust you are not neglecting your daily training, hmm? Why don't you talk about taking your wife around the world so she can cheer for you? Hmm, do you have a moment? It's almost time for the temple's prayer session. Who do you pray to? Or do you have no recipient for your prayers? Pay it no mind. We all gather in a single place to share a moment's meditation. You have ascended to the higher worthy of your presence in this place. What you witness there may serve a new guidepost to you. Open the eyes of your heart and rediscover the world anew. For her. What is strength? Yeah, let's go. I will fight you with my strength and please do not teleport everywhere. Sending you ice. Oh! No blanket ball. I can't go through that. Brah. Not coming out. Brum. Let's go! He's at level 69. Oh wow, look at that sit up. He he does a small yoga flame. He teleports me into the back and gets me with something. And then he launches super. It's three moves in once. Hey Sims. Oh god, I didn't mean neutral. Oh wow. Well reacts to exactly what I'm doing. Ah. Oh god. Let's see if it works. Boom. Alright, we are done. We are done. Last place. The place where it ends. Uh, we need to go to the central bazaar. Because Jury is at the bottom. And then JP shows at night time. Not daytime. I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure I was wrong. And also interesting enough, if I ever do get the Rashid uh, DLC when it becomes available for me, for this system, then we will be in the right place. Uh, yes, I'm going down the right place. Oh, you tech me! You dude bag! Oh, come on. Sweeping. Or am I? Bruh. 
I'm getting whooped by these assholes. Wow, that actually works out so well. Oh. Okay, now let's go in. Show yourself. Oh my gosh, she's not here during the day. Alright, everyone's here during the night. That's why. It's around the corner. Here we go, jury. I saw. A prison, huh? What is it this time? I see check. What is that? Wrenches. Hey, uh, you've never worked on a motorcycle before, have you? A good pair of tools never wears out if you want to make yourself useful. Give me some oil or cleaner or something. And forget fuel. That's stuff is just beginning to get stolen or set on fire. Hey, she's not that far off. You want to repay me for my help? You never learn, do you? Bah. The hell is this? I have no use for it. You can have it back. But first, I'm going to use it on your face. Where do you want it? Your ears or maybe your mouth? You want to repay me for that? Yeah. Huh? Ah, bra. Huh? Excellent. And take the prepay card. Huh? Ah. One more! Okay. Hey. You wanna hear about my childhood? Took about a lifetime ago. My dad was a prosecutor. He wielded justice like a blade, slinging evil rules left and right. The whole country respected him, myself included. I did as he told me and polished my taekwondo skills. I was a perfect student, both on paper and in the dojang. I won to tournaments and they called me the beautiful genius. But it was all pointless. Dad had a criminal organization ba backed into a corner and then they struck back. I was in the car with my family when we got boxed in. What happened next was straight out of a crime drama. My family was killed and the world turned its back on me. I spent the, ro the rest of my formative years in hell. And that, my friend, is some crap I just made up on the spot. You swallow any story that I fed you, what's even the point? Well, look at you, you've really come a long way. Thing is, everything I've taught you up to now was all a load of bull. Wait a sec, wait a smirk. Puh, you knew? And you're thanking me for allowing you to build inner strength? Sheeks, what are you, some kind of bacterial that grows on con artists? Whatever, if you're stronger now, you better prove it by kicking my ass sometime. Yeah. Unlike you, 
I hate having the wall pulled over my eyes, so don't you dare think about running. So hey, I really ran into you back in London, right? I never forget a road I drive down. Man, those were some good times. <laughs> I'm not talking about you and Bosch. I mean the time I tore through London when I was in, in Brazil. I picked up a pair of twin dolls with an interesting backstory. I brought them back to London. The cops in Shedaloo on my tail. Every step of the way was one crazy moment after the next, with the climax at sea. We ended up caught in a storm and damn, even the Feng Shui engine wasn't busting me out of that jam. Lucky for us, the blonde doll knew her way around the boat, but even then we were close to being completely screwed. If only the silver haired one wasn't nipping, napping, the three of us could have had a blast together in that nightmare. Street Fighter 5, right? Let me teach you how to really win fights. Do all the crap your opponent hates. Yeah, let's do this. It's just finished. Alright, jumping in. Oh, I should not jump in. Ah, can't counter it. Oh, one of these got to jump. Got to jump. She's going to jump, right? She's not jumping. Bra. Okay, that's fine. Come on, I need you to jump. Oh. Ah, oh, it missed! Come on. Fine, that's fine. That's it. Okay. It's scary. Boom. Do this in one. Oh, here we go. That's done. Okay, one more to go. Well, damn, that wasn't a waste of my time after all. Okay. Quickest way up. Faster travel. JP, the only one left. Ah, oh, she's got stuff to say. How's stuff on your end? You're in Metro City these days, right? What's the vibe like right now? The gangs have a field day. Fighters, so many fighters. <laughs> fighters, huh? Those suckers used to hide away in the mountains. Now they're scurrying everywhere. Just prove the world's gotten smaller. Sounds like they might be able to show me a good time though. If I roll into town, show me what's up, okay?
Crips. You're traveling the world, right? You got a house somewhere? Right in the heart of Metro City. This modest part is in Metro City. Sick. Means you can make yourself scarce whenever you get in trouble. I'm gonna crash there next time I'm in Metro, uh, Metro for work. I'm your master, remember? Better roll out the red cover when I grace you with my presence. I'll be waiting. Yeah, serious red carpet? Make it happen. Right, where are you, JP? Can see you standing from here. Ooh. Why, thank you. You need the antique playing cards. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're giving me trash? Good luck, charm, you say. Hmm. Mm. Oh, God, it's Close. up there already. Thank you, I humbly accept. Yari, yari. In any card game, using all cards is forbidden. That's a fundamental rule. You, I'll have you know. Hmm. Appreciated. I suppose I should thank you. Yari, yari. In any card game. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. Hmm. Yari, yari. Hmm. Yari, yari. Hmm. Okay. Yari. You selected me as a teacher of your own volley volation. Volley volation the volition? Or so you think, isn't that right? Reflect upon the human will for a moment. To what extent are your actions consciously acts? It is a famous experiment a person thinks I wish to move my arm. And does just that. But in reality, it is only after moving your arm that your brain thinks upon it. <laughs> Fascinating, is it not? The sensations of willfully choosing something only occurs after the choice has been made. In which case, what do you believe you've chosen by studying under me? <laughs> I wish to become stronger, perhaps. Was it truly you who thought that? Once there was an organization called Shadowloo. They ran an experiment to attempt to imbue a large number of test subjects with psychopower. By force, in most cases, goodness, Shadowloo was simply dreadful. Subjects without a propensity for psychopower were broken by its utterly and perished. Only a selected few had this aptitude. And even few endured the training necessary to master such power. You are one of those lucky few. Or perhaps, perhaps Psycho Power has chosen you. But you are free to interpret things as you please. Alright! Physical combat! Yeah. Let's go! Okay, this is the last match for the night. Let's see what you got, JP. And also, what do you actually have for me? No damage? Not happening. Don't think so, anyways. Or can we? Ah. Got me. Nope. Sorry. No dice. Just flying in the air. The scarf. Oh, misses. Ah. Want to get snazzy at him? We'll do this though. Ah, uh, maybe not. That was fancy. Dang it. Range for the punch is so short. I'll take it. Oh. Oh. Here we go. 
Oh, he survived. Okay, I got, I got one for you. If I can get out of the hellhole. Alright guys, that is it. That will do. Okay. Yep, that's it. Everyone has been mastered. Mastered, mastered, mastered. We are... What, everyone's born to our hundred. I laugh, there's like one person missing and we go back to it. No, oh, they're all done. Okay guys, for now, we are gonna go back to arcade mode. But we will do that possibly later today. But for now, thank you for watching. Have a good day, good night, wherever you may be. I am going to sleep. Adios, guys. I'm out.